If climate change is your big issue, then here are some tips for how to think about your ballot in the March 5th election. There's a lot of power to act locally in this global crisis, and officials can take action in lots of different ways. They make decisions like where we get our energy from, how much housing we build and where, how much public transit we have access to, what rules businesses have to follow to cut down on their emissions, how we respond to wildfires or floods. Because so many different policies affect the climate, it helps to pick some areas that are important to you and use that to evaluate the candidates. How specific are their proposals? Do they have many climate-friendly policies or just one or two? Now here are the offices on your ballot with the most direct impact on climate policy in your neighborhood. Your city council member and county supervisor make laws that affect your daily life in LA. They can push for crosswalks and protected bike lanes that make your neighborhood less reliant on cars. They can pass big laws like phasing out oil drilling in LA, which actually they already did. The state assembly and state senate make laws that all cities and counties in California have to follow. You might have heard of a composting law they passed that requires all cities to have a composting program. So if you think your city isn't doing enough on climate or you think other cities need to be moving faster, you can focus on these state races too. We have guides to all these races and more at LA's Voter Game Plan. Head to LAist.com slash vote.